Hello, how's it going everyone? I'm I'm okay at gaming and today I'm going to be testing the most well-known money-making methods for mid-game players. You might ask, what qualifies a mid-game player? And the answer is simple. A mid-game player is someone who has good gear but not the best gear for a specific thing. As an example, take mining. You could have Full Sorrow and a Gemstone Gauntlet, which isn't as bad as Glacite and a Mithril Pickaxe, but isn't as good as Devon with an X55. So I'm going to be going over four different methods today, and we can see which one works best. I'm going to do each of them for 30 minutes and then multiply my earnings by two to find the amount of coins per hour. So without any further ado, let's get into it. So after half an hour of gemstone mining, I've made about 900,000 with a fairly mid-tier setup. To go back over my skills and stats really quickly, um, I'm using Sorrow and a gemstone gauntlet. Um, so we have that going. I don't have maxed anything pretty much, so this is not the best you're gonna get. Um, and if we go to my heart of the mountain which we can see right up here um i've got this kind of formation and these perks throughout so yeah we have that um to be honest in my opinion if you are not late game and you can't afford a really nice mining setup don't mind i might have been doing something wrong but right now Mining Jasper Gemstone uh, with a mid-tier setup comes out to be about 1.8 million coins per hour, so uh, <laughs> not the greatest. Alright, next method. After about half an hour of grinding these, this is what we got. We got three of these, four of these, two of these, six of these, four of these, and two of these. So we are going to throw them up on the auction house and see how much they sell for. Alright, and there we go. After about 30 minutes of grinding automaton parts, um, we made 2.5 million coins. So this will come out to be a little bit more than 5 million coins an hour. However, the lobby I was in was really busy, meaning I could have gotten even more. My setup of choice for this was 3 fourths Sorrow with a Warden Helmet and a Black Cat Pet. 
I would use my Aspect of the End to teleport around, and I would use my Juju Shorpo with explosive arrows to kill all of the automatons. Um, honestly, this is one of the best money-making methods I've found so far. 10 out of 10. Alright, so we have now done half an hour of summoning eye grinding, and from that I got, um, <laughs> I got myself three crystal fragments and one combat EXP boost. I did not get any summoning eyes, um, and that's probably just my RNG, so that could change, could be a little bit different for you. However, personally, this is the worst money-making method we've seen so far. These are, uh, it's telling me 90,000 coins each, and this is about 280,000 coins each, plus the little over 116,000 uh, coins. This is going to put us at around 1 million coins an hour. So, if you have luck similar to mine, <laughs> I would suggest against it. Um, my equipment for this was 3 fourths Necron with the Satan head, I didn't know what to use for the helmet, uh, a Juju short bow, and then an aspect of the end, and then when it came to pets, I used my Black Cat for extra speed. <laughs> Alright, and after all of that pumpkin farming, we came out with, uh, 357,000 coins. So, um, this is not a very good money-making method, and I personally wouldn't recommend it, um, because this is coming out to be about 700,000 coins per hour. Um, so yeah, if there's that, not, not too great. After doing all four money-making methods, the winner is fairly obvious. Whilst it does rely on your luck, grinding automatons is one of the best mid-game money-making methods there is. I also chose to not include auction flipping, as that one is fairly spotty, but it can make money as well if you know how to do it. So in recap, mining gemstones was alright, farming pumpkins was not good at all, zealots were unlucky, but Automatons paid out. Coming in at over 5 million coins per hour, it took the top spot. Well, I hope you all learned something from this video and maybe found a new money-making method to try out. So thank you everyone for watching and consider subscribing if you haven't already. Goodbye!